Run English by Ariane Watford. About the artists, Ron English's medium consists of illustrations, paintings, sculptures, and memorials. His inspiration is superhero comics, art history, advertisements, and pol political topics. His themes are cultural standards and mocking messages that create controversial and thought-provoking works he calls propaganda. He got his schooling from Texas and got his master's degree in fine arts. He worked all over the world through art shows and did illustrations for Super Size Me, Slash, and the Danny Warfers, and also designed toys. What do you find most interesting about your chosen artist? He stands out not because he has an interesting style, but because he designs his work with the 80s and 90s adult in mind. English trippy style and disturbing characters are featured often with skeleton smiles and exposed sexual parts. Through his playful and nostalgic art, he pushes thought-provoking material to his viewers with ease. What are your observations of this artist's work? Mousetrap, 1999. Mickey represents consumerism or a big corporation, while the rat trap represents anything from taxes, bills, new entertainment, advertisements, or the need for money. Mickey's smile represents the need to keep up appearances despite the growing issues within the company illuminated by the blood. Make supersized. The humanoid cows at Ronald's feet, posing in a seductive position, represents McDonald's burgers, making the burgers on equal footing to sexual or the need for illegal drugs. Also, the cows appear to be looking up at something the viewers cannot see, giving the impression that they are excited about the next potential customer, the viewer. In addition to Ronald's large size, could reflect how the customers look. The colors of the background causes Ronald and his heifers to stand out, casting a drug-induced carnival effect or a trippy jail cell. Honey Butts, 2020 Pop International Gallery. English is able to twist the familiar trust about honey nut Cheerios or honey butts and shock the viewers with the not so healthy cereal. Evidence from the unhealthy words on each, on every inch of the box. By doing this, English is protesting against the corporation's fatty ingredients and advertising mints that are controversial to the claim, claimed benefits. A great example of this is the size of the mascot that is pointing to the words size matters. It is a nod to the size of cereal consumers eat in one sitting and the show supersize me.